It's got a lot of soul to it, doesn't it? It's eh? not, it's, it's hey guys, it's Archie Luxury on the Archie Luxury channel. And today, guys, I want to tell you a BMW story. That's correct, guys. I've got the BMW 330i M Sport. I love my BMW. Anyhow, anyhow, I have been following my oil and filters changes every 10,000. And one of the other things I like to do is get a wheel alignment. A wheel alignment. You know, basically you want to make sure the alignment is good because you want even tire wear. Now on the BMW 330, we've got staggered tires, meaning the back tires are different to the front. Mm, interesting. Very interesting. So I've uh, I got to tell you the story. I did some research and it says you should get your tires checked 10 to 15,000 kilometers. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So I got the tires, the alignment checked. Uh, I got the car in February, February, February 2022. It had 4,000 kilometers on it. And then I proceeded, proceeded to get the tires checked at 10,000 kilometers. In fact, I've got the invoice, I've got the invoice, invoice right here because I, I naturally I keep all my invoices and they, they said to me, let me tell you what they said to me, they charged me <coughs> 75 bucks, 75 bucks and that, that was for a, what did they say here? Seventy-five dollars. Uh, I'm not going to name the tire company, but they basically said, um, "Okay." They basically said to me, "Tires rotated to best position. Tire balance." Uh, so they basically looked at my. Uh, so they, they, they basically, this was, I did this in May, May 2022, May 2022. And they charged me 75 bucks for a wheel alignment and balance, you know. And then they said to me, they said to me that, oh, sir, by the way, your tires look like they've got 5,000 kilometers of life left. You're going to have to change them soon and i immediately thought oh no no tell me tell me it's not so and they said yes sir and they actually gave me a quote they gave me a quote for some bridgestone torenza tires and they were they were pretty damn expensive pretty expensive 456 bucks so um that's what they told me so then so then i did nothing the car now has got the car now has got 20 just under 25000 kilometers so 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 that was when the car had the car had on it then the kilometers of the vehicle, the odometer, 9,819 kilometers, and they said 5,000 Ks worth of driving before I'd need to replace them. So it'd be about 15,000 kilometers. Now I took the car in for a wheel alignment, and the car's got just under 25,000 kilometers, and they tell me Tires are wearing well, they're fine. They're fine. So I gotta tell you, I don't know what to say. I mean, I don't think they were lying to me. I, I hope I look, I I I kind of uh I don't know what to say. It's 
it's it's a tricky thing. Tricky thing. Were they bullshitting me or what were they doing? But anyhow, um, maybe it's the BMW surcharge. The BMW surcharge. But I was very happy to hear the tyres are wearing well. They're wearing well, which is good because I didn't really want to replace them. Anyhow, if you want me to be totally honest with you. So, yeah, that's kind of the way it goes. So there you go. That's my entire story. Um, what can I say? I mean, look, you know, you've got to learn to do a Google how to check tire wear. Tire, the, um, the tires need to be, I think it's 1.3 mils. Five mils, they normally say, but it's an interesting thing. Very interesting. Very interesting. So um, I'm not going to question it. <laughs> They've checked the tires. It's been balanced. Let's just leave it be at that. Let's be eager beavers. Let's leave it at that. So that's an interesting tire story. So... Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the way the cookie crumbles. So always just, you know, a bit of research, Google research, find out how to check the the reality from the bullshit. And um, just, just be aware. Just be aware. Sometimes you get some misinformation. I wouldn't say they were trying to get me to prematurely replace them, but who knows? Who knows indeed so um yeah that is the story that is the truth so guys that's the way the cookie crumbles that's the way cookie crumbles so um yeah that's the way it goes that's the way it goes so yep yep Yep, 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 yep. So, um, mm, interesting story about the tires. If you've got an interesting tire story, put it down below. Let's share them. Hi, guys. It's Archie Luxury. Guys, I want to talk to you about David SW. David SW, David SW. Guys, if you are in America, if you are looking for a Rolex watch of your dreams, in fact, if you're looking for a contemporary modern wristwatch, I strongly advise you to look at David SW. Guys, don't play the dealer games. Don't bring in chocolates or crispy creams for your dealer hoping to get a Rolex at retail. It's futile. Please, guys, save your dignity. Keep some pride. Go to David SW. I would highly recommend David SW, David SW. If you're in America and you're looking for a watch, go to David SW, David SW, David SW. Hey guys, Archie Luxury on the YouTube sensation, the Paul Pluto channel. Guys, I need you to help me out, guys. I can't survive on Google Ads alone. I need you to request a paid review. 50 US dollars, look down in the description. 50 US dollars, re I will review your collection. I'll tell you what I think of it and I'll give you some pointers. The other thing is guys, you can sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon allows you to pay a couple bucks a month, a dollar, two dollars, five dollars, whatever you want. And it keeps me going on YouTube because guys, I'm in a niche. Nobody can make money out of the views I get. The views are crap because it's a small specialized area and I don't talk about garbage for the sake of views. Guys, sponsor me on Patreon, look down below, and I will see you in the next one.